Good morning. As I start the introduction of what's going on and what we're going to be talking about, we are going to be talking about this book and the 49ers, not the football team, the actual gold diggers. So I only thought it would be fitting that since they're in the first chapter, they're talking about, you know, they'd break a lot of rocks, uh, quartz rocks and mine gold out of it. So in South Carolina, on my property, I have a lot of quartz. So I decided to give you a little taste of maybe what it was like. Now, obviously, I have a tractor, so it's a little different, right? So I have machinery, but they didn't have machinery. But we're going to try to emulate what they were doing back in the day, right? So enjoy. So what we're doing right now, we're prospecting. Gold. So, what's we do is air conscious mine, basically day number one. What we're doing is we're dipping in some dirt and some, uh, some quartz, and then later, once I have enough quartz, and I'll start breaking it down and trying to get the gold out of it. Okay. So, what, day number three, I guess, of the mine? So, what I got over here is my little strainer so I can get my quartz out. So, what I do, I mean, it's just one, it's a one man army right now. So I put my dirt right there. And uh, I'm just, once I get enough dirt over there, I'll just have a day of pure, just like straining the, the quartz out. But over here, like, so as of right now, this is the mine right here. Doesn't look like much, but you don't need much to mine. So what I'm doing right now is I'm, is, uh, use the tractor to kind of break up the dirt and then I'm just kind of raking it around. See my rake, uh, picking out the quartz. In theory, when you take the quartz right here and you break it up and then you strain it, so I'm getting my little pile together. Then, you know, you strain it and then you put some gold in here. I've seen the process in Africa and watching some YouTube videos. Obviously, the quartz in Africa is quartz from Africa, and this is just quartz from South Carolina. But we're going to give it a test run. I got the other stuff coming in from Amazon. Uh, what? Probably by Wednesday, so we'll check it out. All right, check back in with you. So, yeah, basically, what I'm doing is just picking the rocks. Obviously, this is the best that I can do. I'm not on a river or a creek or any form of water. I'm in the front of my house. But for today's uh, visual, I want to bring, like basically kind of get in the feel of what it felt like maybe back in the olden days for a 49er mining for gold. So what we're going to do, we're going to put this on the bottom so we can trap any of the big rocks because we Obviously, I didn't crunch them all the way, right? I don't have a rock machine. I just had my little hammer. And let's go ahead. Let's see what happens. Got some of the crushed up rocks right here. Got my little shovel. I got some more right here, so I'm gonna take some of this first. Now, later on, 
Uh, it's just now starting to get warm, but I also make moonshine, so it's kind of kind of reminds me of being outside moonshining. So what we'll do is I'm gonna load this a little bit more, just because I kind of need two hands. And then once we get fully loaded, then I'm gonna turn the water up a little bit because it's kind of drickling. Uh, I'm gonna show you what we're looking like fully operational. All right, we are in operation. So you see, <clears throat> got some of the rocks right here. We're gonna shuffle it down there. And you know, kind of adjust it. Kind of will help it kind of keep it down there. So there's little things here to catch the gold and the rivets. So if you're gonna find gold, it's gonna be in your little rivets, or there's like under here, there's little like moss down there for you to catch it. Uh, so yeah, not very interesting. Well, interesting, but uh, not action packed, right? So let me go ahead, run this for a little bit, do some of this, get some of that some of that out of the way and come back with y'all because I'm going to need my hands to do that and then we're going to see what we find. <clears throat> All right. After a couple, well, I don't even know how long it took, but it took longer than a second. We are back. So what you do is we start taking things apart. So we're going gonna to take this off and this off. All right. Let's see if we got anything. Okay, we got some nice mud. Some more nice mud. I see... Oh, what do y'all see? Now, mind you, when it dries up and all that kind of good stuff, I will go through some more and really see if I'm a prospector it's like a 49er but anyways now we see the process now mind you back uh what 200 years ago more or less they didn't have everything that we had uh yeah but this is basically the process of how they would mine gold they'd use their pitch forks instead of a tractor and they'd be wood instead of plastic but you kind of get to see how it was and the sluice and then they'd pick up like the gold would be here and in here and in here and then also caught in your little mat right here so once everything dries i'm gonna shake it all out and then I'll, I'll be able to go through here a little bit more but i doubt i'll put that in the video just because uh i want to finish the video so if you guys get it and i hope you guys enjoy learning about the 49ers as much as i have and have a great day